take Nick the cream, the cream in this Oreo sandwich. There we go. There we go. All right. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Hank Strange. This is Stranger Palooza. I'm at Sunshine State RV. Yes, sir. This is my friend Nick. Hank. What's up, man? How we doing? Great. And uh, we've got a new friend. We do have a new friend today. Willie. How you doing? Go by the way of Cowboy. <laughs> yeah, okay, there you go. Cowboy Willie. So check it out. Today, Willie just bought a van from Nick, and Nick had a great idea. Tell the folks out there what you want to do this video about. Well, I thought it was cool that Willie came in from Mississippi, mm -hmm. looked at a bunch of vans, had a bunch of checklists. We spent a lot of time together, and he pinpointed the one that worked best for him. Yeah. And so there's a lot of questions that people ask on YouTube, on here when they're here, and Willie asked a lot of the same questions. So Willie is nice enough to do this video with us. Yeah. And we he's can go through the process. Yeah, he's gonna tell us why did he buy this particular van, and we'll let you guys know what that is. Yeah. And we'll get all into it right now. I want to remind you that we have these Vanasaur t-shirts and a new one is out. This is Campfire by Moonlight. New Vanasaur t-shirt, that's how you pronounce that if you're a fan of Class B camper vans, whether it's Sprinter, Promaster, or the Transit. You can get these t-shirts, show your love for that, and support Stranger Palooza. And we don't have any like logos or anything like that on it. Plus you can get Stranger Palooza t-shirts. If you look down here in YouTube, there's a store down there. You can check out the store, get this and other designs. And from Lola and myself, who did all the work designing this, uh, thanks very much. See you on the next one. Nick, yes. so introduce us to Willie. Hey, so this is Cowboy Willie. Right. He is in from Mississippi. What's the name of the city? Tupelo, Mississippi. Tupelo. Okay. I found out that that's where Elvis was born. Did you know uh, that? I heard of Tupelo. Must be because Elvis, Elvis was born there, you said, right? Exactly. I thought he was born in Graceland. He moved to Graceland. Oh, okay. There yeah. you go. So yeah. much when, when he got the money. When he so. got the money. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so anyways, so Willie served our country for 20 plus years. And Willie, we greatly appreciate that, my yes. friend. Thanks. Greatly appreciate it. Yeah. Served our country in the military 20 plus years. Army Time guy. Army guy. Army guy. Yeah. Wow. Don't hold it against him. <laughs> no. Big compliment for that. Right. He's retiring and he's deciding, him and his wife, want to RV. So yeah. they were thinking of a big one, medium size, small, I'm not really yeah. sure. The classic question. <laughs> Every day. Yeah. And they started watching Hank's videos. Uh -oh. Started watching me and Hank argue back and forth about things, right? Correct. And then said these crazy guys might be onto something on these small vans. Right. So ended up watching a bunch of videos, got some ideas, called us, said I'm interested in the Coachman Galleria, an American Coach Patriot, and a Winnebago Aero. So three great RVs and we have them all here in Gainesville at Sunshine State Absolutely, RVs. Absolutely, yes. And came down here and we're going to kind of go through the process of kind of what what Willie was wanting, what he was what thinking Willie? about, what Willie what would, wants. Yeah, what would Willie do? What would Willie do? So you got to, what'd you get Willie? What is this? That's the first thing you got to know about van life. It's a Winne, Winnebago Era. Winnebago Era, awesome. Era, and this yeah. model is the 70A, and we'll kind of get into what makes it yeah. unique and what it is and all that. It's on a Mercedes Sprinter chassis. His wife thought 24 feet might be too long, right? Exactly. And yeah. then he thought 24 feet was just the right size. Yeah. So they kind of went back and forth about that right. a little bit. I can make a joke here. I'm going to refrain. And we don't make size jokes. <laughs> so kind of going back and forth. They FaceTimed a lot yesterday because she's in Mississippi. Okay. She couldn't come. Okay. So she's trusting her husband. You ever know oh, that? Boy. Oh, my Lord. I would not make this decision for my wife. Let me tell you. Right. I got to, uh, yes. So. They FaceTimed a lot, they talked a lot, Willie asked a lot of questions, and there was a lot of things that were very important to Willie. And I think as we walk through the RV, these are a lot of the same questions that people that watch your videos ask, yes, Hank. absolutely. I think you guys are gonna find that Willie made a good choice, my opinion. Obviously, what do you like, need, yeah, like you said, you know, there's always different things we would get. Yeah. But we're gonna go through this. Uh, where do you want to start? Yeah, let's yeah. start right here. Yeah. It's a Mercedes. Mercedes. That was one thing that you know they wanted the Mercedes. This is the Mercedes. You know, as we kind of walk through, you'll see. You know, it's a 24 foot Sprinter. Let me walk on the other side of you here, Willie. Yeah. What was, that was a big thing to you, Willie. You like the uh, Sprinter vans? I did. Okay. Uh, I, I like the stance of it. Mm -hmm. I like the look. Mm -hmm. And with this Winnebago met all the criteria that I was looking for. Mm -hmm. Didn't meet all of my wife. 
<laughs> but we okay. came we came to accept what we had that we could work with. Okay. And that's always the thing that I tell people yeah. about a class B. And this is what I told you yesterday was in something this small, you can't get every single thing you want. You can get most of them, but being yeah. flexible about a few things that you want is really very important as yeah. part of it, you know. Yeah. So one thing that's really cool is about these, I love this big wide opening, but you'll notice something a little different here. Yes, I do. I noticed there's What a, do you notice, Hank? There's a TV right here. I'm there's guessing a TV. A, so, a smart TV monitor. Pretty cool. Oh. Couple yeah. options. You open this awning and you have a TV outside. You can be playing the sports game. You know, we're Florida Gator fans here. Right, right. I don't know. What's the Mississippi thing? <laughs> I, I got to go with the LSU. L oh, oh, they play okay. Saturday. I got to go with LSU. Oh, oh boy. Are they, they're not playing the Gators. They're playing like, this Saturday oh, okay. in Gainesville. All right, let's not even get into hold it, guys. On. You have a, hold on, Willow. I didn't know any of this. We got to survive through this. We no, might need to take a pause no, no. on this video. I have to go with LSU. Oh, oh boy. Goodness. Are we, uh, I hope are we make a friendly wager here? Uh, lunch. I'm in. Uh -oh. Lunch. So okay, so when whoever get wins is getting me way. lunch. I get lunch from whoever wins. Is I'm that... feeding you lunch today, Hank. I don't oh, want to hear okay. nothing about you and lunch. lunch okay. anyway. You get lunch every day. <laughs> okay. All right, so we have a friendly wager. LSU, Florida, this Saturday in the swamp. You're buying me lunch when we All win. Right. Okay. All right. Let's see. Okay. Perfect. All right. All right. So, so pretty cool. You can let cool. the awning out. You have the TV here. This is a smart TV. It's also hooked up to a uh, DVD player if you want, hooked up to Wi-Fi so you can watch Netflix and all that. So pretty neat. The biggest thing that Willie communicated was that his wife is gonna be working from the road. Yeah. She works for a very cool nonprofit. Exactly. And and she can travel around working. So he's mm -hmm. like, Nick, I'm retired, mm -hmm. but my wife is still working. So okay. I need something that my wife can work and I can fish. Okay, so she right? can work remotely. That's part of it, Nick. Right. <laughs> so you told me. You said you're going to make your wife work and you're going to fix. Not going to make her work. I don't think he wants that on camera, Nick. Oh, I'm we sorry. don't want that on camera, Nick. You mean you're yeah, going to help her now. work. Right, right. Support her while she yeah. works. Exactly. Come on. So you're going to go fish, bring the yeah. food home, right. cook it for her, cook it for her and yeah. then while she's working. And when and she gets then, off, supper will be ready. Exactly. Hey, right, I like that. Yes. I like yeah. that. While so, his wife is sitting right here so, that's working and he's fishing, he could also be massaging the feet or something like that. That while he's waiting to uh y'all are giving my wife a lot of ideas here. <laughs> so pretty yeah. cool this was really important to him mm -hmm. so willie has two grandkids seven two, and eight seven and eight seven and eight so what was also real important was that his grandkids had somewhere they could sleep sit and be comfortable mm -hmm. a lot of class b's don't have that unless you go to a pop top and that's not for everybody you know mm -hmm. and the pop tops aren't on the mercedes okay. so being that he needed somewhere for his wife to work he needed somewhere for his grandkids to be able to right. sit and sleep this was a great option, right? right. So, so you could seatbelt people in this. Seat them there. Mm -hmm. This also makes a bed, Hank. Oh, it does. So this. So how whole many thing, people could seatbelt in that? Well, I don't know about that. Okay. But um, when you're in here, okay. Here, jump on in, Willie. Come on, right. you guys go in. Go so, down. very comfortable seat there. Mm -hmm. She can have. There's a table leg here, so you can have a table here. She can be working. Mm -hmm. She can also hook her laptop up to that monitor right there. Right, yeah. So that's the. So you can have dual monitors. Mm -hmm. You can have the table here. She can be working up here, and Willie can be sitting in the back watching TV. Mm -hmm. He can be outside, and and they can use this on how they're going to use it. So this is the 70A model, which is really neat. Yeah, it has the cool. workspace here. It has the big kitchen. Big fridge was another thing Willie mentioned. You wanted something with a big fridge. Yes. And then it has the fixed beds in the back. Is the intention, I love these, uh, I like the cabinets Isn't here cool? and how they uh, all blend in. Yes. Very nice feel. And uh, is this, you guys are planning on going full time? Eventually. Eventually, okay. Yes, eventually. eventually we want to actually go full time. Okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. So really quick, I'll just go through here. So you got a big fridge as Nick is saying, right Nick? You got the bathroom, very nice, the cabinetry. Nice, Let's, nice big bathroom. Uh, these fold, look at that, what? That folds, got a bathroom in here. The I sink. like that teak floor, isn't that cool? Uh, yes, that is cool. And the sink is usable. <laughs> so I like that. Immediately. Head, yeah. curtain rod, yeah. hang clothes up, hang towels in there. Yeah, really nice. And uh, then we're gonna, back to the bed here. Isn't that neat? Look at this. So you can come in. So there is something here that you can connect all this, right? Correct. And, There's and a wedge in here that you can connect it. These also go up and down so you can recline as you're laying. Let me jump in here so people yeah. can see what it looks like. Yeah, exactly. So when you're laying here, plenty of room. 
so you can sleep and then this this here goes up and down to where uh -huh. you can recline you can watch tv there's plugs and speakers and lights and all this cool stuff right but if you're gonna full time it mm -hmm. is a little more comfortable to have a fixed bed in the back yeah so you know one of the things that that willie communicated was he's like you know i think if this goes as he's planning it in the next year or so mm -hmm. he's gonna full time so this was important for him to have a real comfortable sleeping situation yeah back here so i agree with that and you guys will see there's also storage and everything other oh, than yeah. all these really great cabinets oh, tons, so. tons of storage here yeah this is here i really, really like this all man. the way isn't it cool yeah all the way around. I think this is the, we've done an era, but this is the first time doing this. Is this is a 70 A. So this is the first time. Then there's a big check this out. Here, man. you're gonna have to take the camera. On oh, this, one. this is dangerous. Giving me the oh, camera. Boy. Check these guys <laughs> out. We'll never get it back. <laughs> so here, I always like when they give you these things where you can store things in it, open and close it. There's three of them all the way. What is there. that I see with carpet? And, and then there's a a place you can hang up clothes. So oh, very yeah. cool. Yeah. See, we got three guys in here. Move around. Fit good, move around, yeah. lots Willie's of space. Willie's probably, you know, a little bit more svelte than I am. Well, Willie uh, was in <laughs> yeah. service for 20 years. He's been eating donuts for 20 yeah. years. Yeah. Um, uh, so, as, as... I've been eating donuts longer than that. <laughs> that's a true statement. <laughs> so, nice, you know, one of the things about these nice, big... Yeah, this is cool. ...storage there. Wow. But I like having a big sink like this. So, you know, you... The probably won't always have that TV there. Mm -hmm. So when you remove that TV, you have a nice big sink where you can prepare meals. Yeah. Willie can cook up the fish that he catches for his wife. So this exactly. is, so this has propane on board. It, it does. Yep. Oh, cool. Yeah, really neat. Yeah. So Willie, what's your favorite fish to uh, catch and cook up? I'm not picky. No. No. Whatever I, God I, gives I, you. I like the Browns. Okay. Okay. I like it. I like it. Look at this. I, I also them. like going to the store and actually have them prepared for me. Oh. <laughs> so, so what's cool about this storage tank is that it goes through. So you can go outside and open oh. it and you can access it from the outside as well. Okay, cool. Yeah, look at that. Okay. And then so they, this could be like a little bar. Yeah. It could, this could be. be like a little, uh, a little mini pass bar. pass through mini bar. Yeah, that's cool. I like that. A lot of great options. Yeah. There's a, there's a table right there. There is. And then this, this TV comes right out. And you can store it so not yeah. everyone's always going to use the tv right there right and so you can easily just get rid of the tv store it somewhere where you're not using it and you can and you can have a bigger counter but when you want to use it it's right there yeah this has a look what? power doors yeah. fancy that is lock ourselves in Living here in a lap of luxury over yeah. here and real quick the mercedes side of this you know the the sprinter side very nice it's got like the carbon fiber so this has the 10 inch mercedes layout, screen yeah. It has the power door, was that button right there. It also has push button start, laser cruise, all the safety features that that these uh, Mercedes Sprinters come yeah. with. Power and heated seats, oh. nice big storage there. Yeah. Yep, yep, it's just like that. It's nice big storage here. Oh, okay. That's that DVD player that I mentioned. So, oh. one of the other things, here, you can take this. Oh, one of the oh other things, I can get this back now? I mean, oh, thanks, Nick, I appreciate it. One that. of the other things that Willie said was real important is uh -huh. internet. His wife needed to have internet on the road. Right. So we've talked a few times, Hank, about that 5G router that we've been installing a bunch. Mm -hmm. And so this is a perfect spot for it here. And there's a port that we can put the antenna right on the roof. Really so true. everywhere okay. that, that Willie goes with his wife, they will have internet ever 5g internet everywhere they go right. so so that way she can jump on hook this up to the laptop access it but what yeah. else is neat is you can have smart tv so if you watch netflix amazon prime any right. of those espn you can watch lsu get whooped by the gators this saturday so uh what are you going to be doing are you gonna i've heard that you'll do a youtube channel is that you thinking about that do some my, social media I'm, I'm thinking about it I want to yeah. do it I want to share my me and my wife mm -hmm. experience okay and 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 doing RV yeah what is this channel gonna be called that's my question um, do you know grand grandkids haven't came up with a name oh. yet how about okay. Cowboy Willies that's going to be the grandkids responsible gonna, they're yeah. coming up with a name. I think I think it should be called uh, what would Willie do <laughs> what would Willie do I like that that I way like we that. could get some credit Nick we can get yeah. a little bit of credit yeah, for something. We, we could claim residuals. <laughs> yes. Yeah, no, Willie's cool. an interesting guy. Yeah. If, if you watch his story and you learn about Willie, 
the sacrifices he's made, what he's done for our country, and then just kind of you know how how he wants to spend his retirement. I've I've loved getting to know him, mm -hmm. and uh, you know helping him through this process. You know Austin, who's one of our uh, salespeople here, yep. helped a lot, and then I kind of came in and heard heard kind of what he was talking about, but. You, there's just a lot of a lot of cool uh, knowledge and experience in Willie that I think anyone that watches his channel would we'll appreciate. Hundred percent, hundred percent. So let us know, you know, when you do the YouTube channel. Now I think you were also saying that one of the big reasons you wanted this is you were looking for a generator, right? Yes, it was okay. very important to have that peace of mind to mm -hmm. know that I could always have power. Okay. Uh, the solar is great. But to know that I have a backup is mm -hmm. even better. Okay. Are you finding there's less and less coming with a generator? Yeah, you know? so so it's always an option. The Era mm -hmm. is something that's always come with a generator. Okay. So Winnebago okay. makes the Winnebago Bolt, which is their lithium version, mm -hmm. and then the Era, which is the generator oh, version. Okay. Coachman offers it either LI3 or non-LI3, mm -hmm. American Coach, same way. But Winnebago's kind of just made two lines mm -hmm. like that. But there, there are people i don't want to say i mean i a lot of people want lithium but a lot of people like you hank i mean you yeah. wanted the generator you know yeah. generators are so quiet they're so easy to use now and you have the flexibility of adding lithium to it kind yes. of like you did and we've talked about this yeah adding lithium so you have both you have lithium and a generator which which is a pretty cool setup that's what i like about the generator you can always step it up to lithium you can you, can. you know not everywhere you go will you be able to plug in and the solar panels correct. won't run everything if correct. you're living correct in here so you have that flexibility and it seems like there's a lot of space in here it's lots of space especially in the back battery. we'll show that before yeah. we're done mm -hmm. but What's cool about the generators now compared to 10 years ago is they're very quiet. Yeah. Whisper. I mean, they're so quiet, you cannot hear it in the RV or outside the RV. Okay. So 10 years ago, they sound mm -hmm. like a loud lawnmower that you you, mm -hmm. you couldn't even sleep. It'll vibrate the whole RV. Mm -hmm. Now, they're very quiet, they're very quieter, easy yeah. to use. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, so they're great. So yeah, so that was Willie's really saying. He wanted a generator. He wanted the a work area for his wife, mm -hmm. a place for his grandkids. He wanted something that had a very comfortable bed. Well, I had to have good internet, wanted a sprinter. So kind of going through the, the things that we had, this this was kind of the fit. But it was cool that Willie being in Mississippi, mm -hmm. you know, coming here to Gainesville and right. being able to see all of that in one location. Yeah. How many different vans did you look at? It's about three or four. Okay. You drove if you were it, it took it took all it was all day all day thing. Was it worth uh, test driving? It, it people was, always ask me, like people tell me they don't want to test drive. What do you think? I think they should test drive mm -hmm. in order to get the feel, mm -hmm. to get to know exactly how it feels and drives and ride, you have to test drive. Mm -hmm. And I think once you test drive, you can start narrowing it down from that point. But mm -hmm. just by looking and listening, you're not going to get that feel. You yeah. need to test drive. Absolutely. And these guys let you... Test drive to your heart's content. Yeah, we so, did. We so did. I, I recommend. You yeah. kept it under a hundred, right? <laughs> I did. Thank, I did. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. You don't have to legally no. tell. You don't have but, to legally uh, disclose that. <laughs> I recommend uh -huh. anyone to come down and see these guys. They're very helpful, very friendly, mm -hmm. and if you're lucky, they'll feed you lunch. I, I got, I got I lunch was, coming for you yeah. today. Uh, the lunch I'm looking forward to is next week when uh -oh. Florida beats LSU oh and you're boy. buying yeah. me lunch. That's going to be lobster. I don't thing. care if it's a 99 cent Big Mac. I, oh. You're I buying will. me lunch when I Florida beats LSU. Next week, so we'll see. You better. I think I'm going to come for that lunch. It better not be a 99 cent Big Mac. But it better cool. involve lobsters. But you know what else is cool is, uh -huh. you know, Willie's here today kind of going through all this. He's going back home. He's flying. We're flying him here next week. That's what I heard get his walk through and he's gonna drive it home because he drove here from Mississippi yeah. Yeah. to make a decision knowing that we had all of these here and that's something that the hang I talk about all the time yeah. is you know coming here spending the time I know not everyone can do it mm -hmm. so we deliver free all over the country but if you have the opportunity to come here and see and sit and lay down mm -hmm. I walked in he's laying down in a bed and mm -hmm. and driving and getting good FaceTime and his wife yeah and I mean you know really <laughs> That's really getting to know these things. Yeah. And, and That's I what think, you should do. Take yes. your time to make the decision. Yes. This can, is how easy is it to take this out? Can we see it? Oh, I, I mean, so there's a little thing right here. You just kind of lay it Hold flat. That. Oh, cool. Just like that. And oh, then yeah. there's an extension that covers this whole area ah. here. And so it makes a little bit. Oh, cool. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Perfect for the grandkids. And. Yeah, or the fur and, babies. I would say, and he's a German one. Shepherd. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what's his and name? And her name is Nola. Her name, Nola. New Orleans Saints. Nola. Kind of like Lola. Yeah. That's cool. Very nice. So yeah, so yeah. 
So Willie, Cowboy Willie, his wife, and Nola are going to be traveling on this. Right. Potentially full time. Yeah. Maybe not. Maybe here and there. Yeah. yeah. But well, we're looking to go full time at some point. Right. We're That's looking cool. to experience what this country has to offer. Yeah. Take your time and yeah. figure it all out and figure out what kind what you need. I think people always go out and buy a bunch of stuff and I tell them don't do that. Exactly what I if tell you, people. Yeah. If you need plates and stuff, get paper plates and plastic. And I also say and use and it and then experience and then yeah. figure out what you want after yeah. that, you know, yeah. because because you don't know what you're gonna need until you're actually out doing it, you know. Yeah. Absolutely. Can we see? Let's go see the back. Where's yep. the generator? The generator is is with the RV. It's with the <laughs> RV. It's somewhere here. Uh, one of the things about this, like you always talk about, everything's uh, integrated. It's got the skirts and everything here. So yes. So really yeah. nice. The generator's under the RV somewhere. It's under here. Yes. There you go. Spare tire is under here. That's cool. And there's a. Uh, that looks like the battery. So I can see the battery under there. Yeah. And so this is this oh, is this is this, this is what's like. pretty awesome. So Winnebago, this is a 70A. It has this big garage storage here. Yeah, I like this. Check that out. Oh, uh, there you go. Isn't that cool? Yeah, that's helpful. That's so you helpful. Keep your stuff to have here. A tray in here. There's also room back there. Yeah, tons of room. And so this is what I was talking about with the uh, up and down things right here, how they recline. Yeah. Yeah, so if you wanted to, you can have your batteries, you could put some batteries inside. You put really. some lithium batteries over right there. there. You know, um, you could also do outside because I don't know how cold places you plan on going. Day but, and night. Yeah. We're going to oh, be cool. those those people that when it's cold, we're going that way. When it's hot, we're right. going that way. <laughs> so uh, it's a search for eternal 70 exactly. degrees. Exactly. So it's yes. kind of like if you take the map, you start like here and you kind of go like that. Like yeah. there's a... There's a uh, wherever the warmth is. Yeah, mm -hmm. 70 degrees is the yeah. goal all year round. Yeah, I'm about to go to California, and I'm telling Lola I'm staying all south. All <laughs> south. Yeah, it's too. This like we're we're almost in November. Yeah. I think I'm going like at the end of this month. I was so. in Indiana last uh, yeah. two weeks ago. It was freezing. It was I, freezing. I was wearing pants and a jacket. And yes. Yeah. Oh, totally you actually have pants? Every, I uh, I do own a pair. Oh, okay. People from Florida usually don't actually. Not have many. Full length pants. Not many. I'm surprised you know what those are. <laughs> long shorts or short pants, would you yeah, call them? Right, exactly. These are short pants. I got yeah. long pants. Hey, Hank, you got to, I mean, Nick, you got to tell them about oh, what we have up top. Oh, oh yeah. That was one of the selling points yeah, for me. Out. So this ladder is cool. Having a ladder. ladder is cool. Yeah. There's also there's a roof rack up top with a bunch of the solar. Okay, well, you going up there? I am. Oh, awesome. You can take the camera. You're getting this camera twice. I'm, I'm privileged. So here, I might take your job, Hank. So you got solar, we got the roof rack. Your old guys are looking at you right now like the boss is climbing up the ladder. So, pretty neat. Yeah. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> the roof rack was something that, that you liked also to have. Yeah, yeah. I loved it. To have a uh, capability to do stuff and and the look of it. You know, we yeah. talk and about clean the clean solar panels when they get dirty. Yeah, you can clean them, but also from having that, you can also put storage and stuff exactly. like that up there. If you guys are gonna live in this full time. You can make good use of having, you know. You know something else we talked there. about was the front bumper. Oh, okay. You know, you want to do something like this, maybe? Uh, Check that thing uh, out. I, I don't know, Nick. I think you're, you're, you're pushing me towards Come something on. that... Uh, this is cool. Isn't this cool? Yeah, That's, so this is from Backwoods. It's from Backwoods. These well, are different lights. So these Backwoods sent these lights? Uh, I believe so. Oh, cool. I mean, they didn't send them. We bought them, but yes. You bought them, yes. <laughs> and there's a big winch. I was winch. just hanging out with the Backwoods guys. Oh, yeah? They told me to say what's up to you. Big winch in so, there. Yeah. I think this will look great, Willie. Yeah, I do too. I think Cowboy Willie needs a modified front bumper. Hey, bumper. like you said earlier, uh, Hank, mm. I have to massage Mama feet a little bit. <laughs> right, exactly. And then maybe I can get that bumper. Maybe, yeah. maybe, maybe. Yeah. No, this is really toys. cool. This is a cool van. Isn't it cool? I like the layout of this van. Oh yeah, absolutely. I think that's pretty much it. We've covered yeah. everything. Hey, you know, one of the reasons, Hank, that I want to do this video, I really wanted people to see, you know, because everyone thinks oh, I'm the only one who lives in another state mm -hmm. and think about coming to Florida and buying this, or I'm the only one that can't decide which one. Yeah. No, every day we have this, what's the best one question asked right. to us. And that same question, asked, Nick, what's the best one? Yeah, I and get so, this question a lot. And so well. I asked yeah. them, name out what you're looking for and let's find the best one. Yeah. Because there's not one best one. There's the best one for Willie right. and this was it. And then there's the best one for you and right. we found it. So yeah. there's a best one for everybody. A guy asked me one time and he sent a whole manifesto of what he wanted and then I had to respond to that. So I made another manifesto 
And I was like, you know what? I gotta actually make a video out of this because yeah. because yeah, it's very complicated. It, is, it fits it everyone. And everybody needs. wants something different, completely yeah. different. And so yeah. I feel like. Willie found the best one for him. Yep. And then people who are watching this, mm -hmm. they're gonna they're gonna say, "Oh, this isn't the best one for me." Yeah. But I like his thought process. Yeah. Willie was very thoughtful, yeah. very I think concise. He, I in think, what he wanted. I think he, uh, you know, he got some of that from looking at us. Believe it or not, I, I, a lot. Some of that. Uh, we 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 got to take a little bit of credit here. Nick. I will say, go on YouTube <laughs> and watch these two guys. They're gonna mm -hmm. make things look bigger than actually <laughs> what they really are. But that's okay. Uh, some you... things that look big are actually big. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> but actually go out there and look, and they right. explain very well uh -huh. in detail and show you everything that this these vans has to offer. Yeah. So that helped us out a lot, me and my wife, and uh, made the decision to come down and actually see the place and see the vehicles, and uh, we was able to find one. Yeah. And uh, I'm looking forward to enjoying this for many, many, many years to come. Yeah. Congratulations, man. Yeah. I'm glad you found us. You found this place. You found Nick. Now he's in that special club. Sunshine Elite Club. Yes. I'm the president. Uh, you're not uh, even the, in it. We, we started doing it the day after you bought yours. We started it. No, the I took over. The day after you, we, you, you bought, we started this club, and he didn't get invited to it. Right. His feelings I, are still I, I, I I'm the president His of this club. All right, I'll be the treasurer. Right, there you go. I'll be the treasurer. All right, so Nick, uh, what do you want the if folks are looking at this, and they also want to you know, ask you guys a lot of questions, come yeah. down here, do whatever, how do they do all that? Yeah, of course. So on our website, we have all the vans we have on YouTube. Me and mm -hmm. Hank do videos. I do videos on my own, and there's a lot of information there. But, you know, just like with Willie, We'll fly you down, mm -hmm. pick out an RV, you can drive it home. Mm -hmm. um, you know, Willie drove down, he's mm -hmm. picking out, he picked out his RV, yep. and then we're flying him in next week to mm -hmm. actually go through the walkthrough. He's in a camp, mm -hmm. he's gonna do everything, learn how to use it, and then he's gonna drive it home on his own. So awesome. there's no right way of doing it. Yes. It's just, you know, the way that works for you, for his schedule, for your schedule, for yep. whoever, but we'll also deliver. So, yep. so we deliver them all over the country every week. We had someone buy, an RV and trade one in this week in Colorado. So one of our drivers got in their new RV, yeah. drove it to Colorado, got their used one, and just drove it back. Oh, cool! And yeah. and and the whole thing was done with us with them never yeah. coming here. Yeah. And then we give technical support over the phone, FaceTime support, Zoom calls, anything that we got to do to make people to help feel you comfortable. Get. And then another thing that you said before we just completely end the video, but for, to get it on record here. You were telling Willie to join one of the many uh, different like Facebook groups oh, yeah. and things like that. So out there's there. so there's yeah. a lot of groups. So Winnebago mm -hmm. Air has a good Facebook group. Right. There's there's another really cool, unique one that I found. I thought I thought Willie would like. It's called Black Folks Camp Two. Mm -hmm. So everyone has that question of man, you know, I would what group is right for me? So there's right. like solo RVers, there's women mm -hmm. RVers, there's this Black Folks Camp Two group. There's lots of cool groups, and I encourage you find a group that that fits the way you camp. Yep. With with the uh, you know the people and the places and the kind of RVs, and it's gonna enhance you, your camping experience and what you do so much better. Right. I don't know any of the guys at that group, but I have followed them, mm -hmm. and I actually bought a shirt for one of our employees from them. So right. it was you know pretty cool, but. But it's there's a lot of great groups out there that will fit what it is you're looking for. Yeah, I know you do the overland stuff, right? And that's the same thing because sometimes it's not that you you don't have to do that, right? Like no, folks enough. out there would say, hey, you don't have to, and I, I would agree you don't have to. But a lot of times people out there are looking at things and they're like, hey, I don't see people like me doing right. this. Right. And I think those kinds of groups help encourage that right. and let you know, hey, there's folks like you out here. Single and, women. There's there's yes, a lot of single the, women the groups. Single, single women, women like, man, yeah. I'm gonna go camp. This is a, a man's world. Right. I'm gonna go camp. Or if you're a black yeah. guy, you're like, man, all these campers are white folks. Or yeah. if you're young, if you're yeah. in your 20s and you decide this is what you want to do, you're like, God, I'm going around my grandparents. There's mm -hmm. young RV yeah. campers. There's black. There's yeah. white. There's and Spanish. all all there's like all, all the van life people will be happy to help you all the RVers out there people out there are, are typically good but yes there's like look for all the groups find what fits you so Willie yeah. served our country for 20 years now yep. it's time for our country to yeah. serve Willie for the next 20 and years. there's there's you by the that? way by you the way Willie that? you're gonna be able to stay on uh, military bases oh, and stuff yeah. like that yeah, yeah, you'll be able to, cool. yeah you'll be able to camp out on that and there's groups for that <laughs> there are, there are. our yeah. friend uh, camping Coasty yeah you know that's he's, he's he in the Coast Guard yeah he does that all the time so shout out to camping Coasty all right that's it we're out of here I hope you guys got some good information from this We'll keep up with Willie and see what he's doing. Maybe reintroduce him what to you guys. What would Willie do? What would Willie like do? It. That's our. That's the question. Yeah, you got to go 
go get that before I put this video up. That's true. <laughs> yeah, we're out of here. Peace. See ya.